Hi, I'm Dr. Morna Foy, president of the Wisconsin Technical College System. There are so many great things happening in our system. That's why I'm visiting all 16 colleges to celebrate our 300,000 students, our staff, faculty, and leadership teams for everything they do to make our campuses vibrant and innovative places to learn and grow. I can't wait to go back to college. The next stop on our tour of excellence is Western Technical College in La Crosse. Western has seven total locations, serving more than 9,000 students across 11 counties. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? I'm good. I've got some uh, women's clothes for you guys. Volunteers like business management student Nick Horning are braving the cold weather outside the Business Education Center to help fill these blue bins. Today we're taking in clothes for the Suits for Success event. So we'll be taking in all these clothes, we'll be sorting them, and then we will be giving them back to the community for mm -hmm. anyone that needs appropriate clothing, whether that's anyone just out of college or just simply anybody that needs professional clothing for their job, and we give it away at no charge. She's got scrubs. Yeah, we were just talking all right, about I'm gonna take the, the scrubs. In less than 90 minutes, okay. The students have already filled nice. 12 bins. All right. Seeing the generosity of people either donating clothes or giving of their time makes me wish there was something like this when I was finishing college. I had to actually take out a loan when I graduated just to buy some clothes yeah. to, to go to an interview in. Because so this, this is, is basically stuff. all I had to wear. And are these men's, women's, Bulls. or mix? All right, great. Oh, thank you so much. You're going to help out a lot of future employees. From clothes wow. to computers. Look at this. This is what they used to call a laptop. Today we're doing the e-waste event. We're working with Dynamic Recycling. Uh, they will take the e-waste that we get here from the community over to their area and then they'll recycle it or trash it in a safe way so it doesn't hurt the environment. Thank you very much. Have a good one. Western Technical College has been doing this for over 10 years, and the students and faculty members I spoke to say they've seen it grow every year. The word I keep hearing is community. Why does Western do this? I mean, this is not a, a typical college classroom. All right, uh, so we are, have a firm belief in community-based learning and making sure that students get that hands-on learning experience. And it really, you, know, you can learn a bunch of stuff in the simulation or in a textbook and that sort of thing, but really experiencing it, planning this event and executing it, you get to see the impact it has on the community. It's that part of that community, that, that involvement that we want to get to show and, and be a part of, um, that it's not just a single tech college, it is more than that. That's for sure. And it's, it's, you know, it's a good way to, A, reduce waste, right? right? That's huge. That's, that's the main component of what we as students are learning, mm -hmm. especially in the IT field and the tech field. Um, but again, it's just being about community. almost 4,000 I love this plants so much. The only, so, the only problem is that I showed my, my wife a picture of this and she now wants me to recreate this in our Well, home. you can do very small ones, absolutely. They're, no, you can do very small <laughs> ones. So our But students, you have to be able to keep the plants alive, Josh, no matter how many of them there are. I want are. a picture. That is challenging, <laughs> yeah. yeah.